What's going on guys? So today we're doing something a little bit exciting, nothing too, too crazy, but I wanted to show you guys how I got some brakes for the R34 and for like seven bucks, we're gonna make them look very nice. I got these for a crazy deal. So these are just uh, some Z32 ones, uh, just for the dual caliper setup. But as you can see, they're like, they're just junk. They try to paint them, I guess. I don't know. I guess they just spray painted them black and then went over with some red. But, oh, they actually got some pretty good pads. But what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna blast all this. We're gonna cover all this up. A lot of times people wanna do is they'll powder coat them, but they wanna take them all apart, take out the seals and all that. Thankfully, you've got a sandblaster. Best thing, definitely go to like Harbor Freight, whatever, I think they're like 40, 50 bucks for like a small little thing here. Got one right here. Literally put that in there. We're gonna cover this up, make sure no like bead goes all around, but uh, just blast this, make this all, clean this up nice, make this all silver. Then we can go ahead and do a new color. Man, surprisingly, these calipers are like so light. I wanted to do another separate video also doing this, like, I don't know if you guys are into it, but just doing like simple little things here. Literally just did this with sandpaper, not even polished yet. So like I said, these two things, well, these two calipers, Gonna just blast these real quick and then get to painting. So this is the color that I went with. I just wanted to go with just a simple like metallic gold. I'm not sure what I wanna do the car color yet. If I'm gonna paint it, if I'm gonna wrap it, I wanted to do either, well this was one of the colors. It was like a grayish black, but that was more of a matte color. And then I wanted to do a blue, like base side blue to paint it. But then I see like a bunch of Bayside Blues R34. And then I was actually kind of leaning towards the Millennium Jade or even some people were sending me like the Midnight Purple. Like I had my R32 or like the Dookie Kookie S14 do it brown, which I have not seen. I only see maybe like two or three pictures of a brown R34. So I was actually thinking about doing that comment down below what you guys think is a good color for the r34 so many more projects here as well finished the r32 kendrick's car is all running adrian's car is almost up we're almost done with the 1j mounting up a bunch of the stuff here that way we can all go out sliding so here we go here's a little look at how it came out after blasting it a little bit now we could go ahead start painting it hopefully it comes out good but i actually like this look too here you go guys, finished product right here. So the only thing I should have done was just sand this a little bit, but like I said, this is gonna be the dual caliper setup. So nothing too, too crazy. It's gonna get scuffed up a little bit, but as you can see, I don't know if the camera does it justice at all, but look at that. Bam, for six bucks for a spray paint can, can't beat it. So all I'm gonna do now is just, I was thinking about just sanding this part down a little bit just to keep that Nissan logo uh, silver, and then just hit it off with a clear and I think we should be good. Uh, actually, I'll probably just keep it like that, just throw some clear on it. I did about maybe like eight coats, let it dry, uh, went with a heat gun back and forth, and then uh, I just let it sit overnight, so I'm just gonna throw the clear coat on it now, and I think it should be good. Also guys, don't worry, uh, we're taking apart all the insides and everything, that way there's no beads or anything in there, so you don't have to worry about that. Just going with the heat gun, heating this up a little bit and spraying some clear. Another five bucks for a can of clear. This one I already sprayed a little bit. You can kind of see it. We'll throw a couple more coats, probably like four or five coats. Get this all nice and hot. It's a little cold in this garage as well. It's probably like 60 degrees in here. All right, there it is. After all the clear and everything, let it focus a little bit. Clear coat's all good. Gonna keep this, was gonna go with the silver on this, but I think I'm just gonna keep it like that. And it looks good. Go ahead and uh, do a dual caliper setup next. All right guys, hope you guys enjoy that little quick video. Didn't want to do it too long. Uh, just to show you a quick little easy way for like seven, 14 bucks with clear coat and just some gold paint. But like always guys, like, comment, subscribe, stay tuned for more, uh, some R34 stuff, R32 stuff. Finishing up on the soup right here. A little bit of different stuff, but until next time guys.